Earlier, the governorship candidate of the People's Democratic Party in the Kogi State governorship election, Senator Dino Melae, called for the cancellation of the election due to the irregularities that marred it. In the press conference on Sunday in Lokoja, the state capital, Milai said that the irregularities that marred the election in all three senatorial districts were unprecedented in the history of the state and should not be allowed to stand. I've manifested more than ever before that they cannot be trusted, they are biased, they are compromised, and they cannot be a neutral umpire. INEC officials, youth call members, were caught yesterday with prepared results sheets even before the commencement of the processes leading to the election. A youth call member was caught yesterday with one million naira in his bag, complete one million naira with a, a prepared results already. There was deliberate suppression of my votes in Lokoja and Kogi local government. This was deliberately done by Ayabelo and the APC to make sure that even in their orchestrated arrangement, I don't come second because they do believe that there will be a second ballot. And they believe that if there's a second ballot, I have tremendous influence and support in the central and I can build an inroad in the east. So they will prefer any other person to come second who will find it difficult to have support in the central and in the west. So with these various malpractices that have bedeviled this election, I call for the total cancellation of this election. I call for a total repentance from INEC we will now conduct a credible pool. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.